the bicycle. It's been around for almost 200 years. And almost as soon as our passion for pedaling began, we were trying to figure out the easiest way to do it. My mother told me one invention was named after me, the moped. And I believe her because she's my mother. Now there's a way to give your legs a rest with an electric boost from behind. We all love the freedom and mobility that a bicycle brings. But let's be honest, sometimes it's a little more work than we'd like, especially when we use our bikes to commute rather than train for a triathlon. Well, inside this innovative space, there are people with a passion for propulsion, and it might just make your ride a whole lot easier. This is known as the Copenhagen wheel, and inside this red hub, there is some seriously compact technology, a motor, a battery, sensors and computers, and together they make cyclists feel better, stronger, faster. I traveled to Cambridge, Massachusetts to find out more about this reinvention of the wheel. This is Asaf Bitterman, founder of Super Pedestrian, the creators of the Copenhagen Wheel. Tell me a little bit about how this works and how did you come up with this? This started from a partnership between the Sensible City Lab at MIT and the mayor in Copenhagen. And the question we asked was, how can we get more people to cycle? Many people want to cycle more, but our cities are so big. How can you use a regular bicycle and handle these big distances or hills? So we decided to power up the bicycle, but to do it in a special way. This red wheel can go on any bike practically, and it transforms it. It makes it into a hybrid electric bicycle. When you pedal, this wheel kicks in automatically, and all of a sudden, life feels like magic. So you think that distance has shrunk or that hills disappeared. And then when you brake, it captures your kinetic energy and stores it in the batteries. The wheel weighs about 13 pounds, and you charge it by plugging it into a wall for about four hours for a full charge. And not including the extended range you get from braking, you can travel up to about 30 miles depending on terrain and other variables. The inner workings of the wheel function in conjunction with an app on your smartphone. Our native app comes with several modes that we prepare in advance for our users. Turbo mode, uh, there's standard mode, eco mode, it stretches your range, and then you can have the wheel work against you, so it's exercise mode. Once you've selected a program, the app gives instructions to the wheel to add propulsion as needed. As a rider, you don't do anything but ride. How is this going to feel differently from a standard bike? You're like Superman. It's very different. It was time to try it for myself, even if the weather outside was frightful. Now, the winter time might not be the best time to go biking, but this thing still works. Wow. This is awesome. I'm barely putting any effort into this. This is amazing. As I stop pedaling and get a little bit of resistance, that's the battery charging back up. And as soon as I start pedaling, I am flying through the streets. I could feel the turbo function propelling me, like a moving walkway in an airport, or like fins in the water. And whether it's exercise or turbo mode you prefer, this wheel will surely put a new spin on the way you commute.